The South Carolina Ports Authority pushing for a new way to get shipping containers off of our roadways while also getting those containers to the right terminal by using a transport barge. News 2's Natalie Price joins us now with why supporters say this could be the traffic relief that neighbors have been hoping for. Natalie, what did you find out? Well, Carolyn, that's right. One of the main goals here is traffic relief. We all know that the Port of Charleston is one of the busiest in the area. And one of the plans the Port Authority has to help alleviate traffic on 526 from trucks carrying those cargo containers back and forth is to keep those containers on the water. And the way they plan to do that is by using a barge, keeping that cargo on the Cooper River. The Port Authority wants to use that barge also to carry cargo from terminal to terminal as the port continues to grow. And as more people come to the area, that will result in a need for more cargo being moved. And if another method isn't used, it also means more traffic on 526. One state representative that I spoke to said there's actually a shortage of truck drivers at the moment, and this change to the barge would actually bring some jobs into the area. You know, we're going to have more and more containers as we have more and more people move here every year in addition to that. So there will be jobs, and in fact, right now we don't have the capability to fill all those jobs. So I actually see this as an opportunity for us to relieve some of the pain that um, the truck driving industry is feeling right now because we don't have the skilled labor for it. The Port Authority is planning to implement this barge by 2022. In Mount Pleasant, Natalie Price, Count On Two.